Good morning, this is Gabriela, and I would like to check why did the S&P and all the markets rally. Uh, here we have uh, on uh, February 23rd, the S&P, the future of S&P made the top and started to decline till February 29. And then I thought that markets will fall because we had uh, a Sun, Mercury, Saturn conjunction in Pisces. And uh, Mercury should bring uh, uh, a correction because Mercury is bad in, uh, is in detriment in Pisces. Okay? But what happened instead the market uh, bottomed here, made a sec it is the one hour chart, bottomed on the, at 3 o'clock in New York time and then make a, lower, a higher low at 8 o'clock New York time and then it started to, to rally, to go up higher than the previous high. So I checked what happened. Why did this happen? It was completely the opposite, uh, the opposite uh, the direction that I thought it would go. And then I went to the heliocentric chart. And in the heliocentric chart we can see that Earth Earth is 120 degrees to Venus. You can see here in the table. Okay, so this is the major uh, good uh, planetary position. And this caused the rally in the in the markets. Now price-wise, uh, 5060 was the low and 5061 was heliocentric Jupiter level. So if I calculate the, the further stop for Jupiter, it will be 5151, the third Jupiter level, and it should go there. And we can also see that the Fibonacci sequence give us almost the same. So will uh, 5156 or 5151 be the last stop? Uh, we shall. We have to see it in the in the chart that starts from the last low, and that was February 13. So on February 13, the S and P future was 49, uh, 30, uh, 39, and. I calculated the dates from the low to the low. It made eight days, which is a Fibonacci number. From the low to the top, it made 15 days, two weeks. Then from, the <coughs> from February 13, nine days, which is also a, day, uh, a sequence that we have to follow, made the, the next low on February 29. And now we are after February 29, and if I draw the Fibo next Fibonacci number 21, we are getting to March 5, when it is also a gun turning date. Now, I made a calculation with mathematics, not only the planets, and these are the support, 51.16 is the support, and these are the targets. As you can see, that the Fibonacci from uh, February uh, 13 shows us 51.80. So this is our first target. If it goes above it, 51, we have here 51.90. Okay, so between 80 to 90 is the next target. And then 52.08, 52.14, 33, and 39, while the Fibonacci number gives us 52.40. So more or less the same numbers and uh, that's it we will have to wait for march 5th for a trade for a, a change in trend okay good luck